coast is clear. If the shore is that way, then the school is probably that way. Sim was the third. Huh? The day after AJ killed Marlon. You already know Violet and I voted for you to stay. A Sim was the third vote. Wait, that means Omar voted us out? And Ruby? Uh, yeah. Huh. What made you think of that? A Sim said you knew how to survive. He could just tell the school would be safer with you there. I voted for you because I liked you. But his reason, it was better. I just, I just thought you should know. Asim was right. We were safer. We were more scared than we let on when you met us. As bad as Marlon was, he still saved me and AJ. And you nursed me back to health. We owed you for that. Maybe, but even so. If Marlon was still in charge, we'd be taken away to wherever, or dead. Instead, we fought back, because you showed us how. We weren't safe with Marlon, even in his safe zone. We were just hiding. Huh? All alive. I couldn't believe you were really dead. I had to try and find you. You did find me. Did everyone else escape? Yeah, they're okay. They took the cart and headed back to the school. We're safe, Clem. All we gotta do now is find our way home. Any idea which way that is? I know an old bridge near here. If we cross it, we won't be too far from the school. Well, we were looking for you guys, and I... I thought you might be... gone for good. Oh. Shit. I was trying to figure out what I'd do if you were gone. And I realized how goddamn stupid I was about Minnie. For a whole fucking year. I was so wrapped up in losing her and Sophie, I pushed away everyone who tried to care about me. Marlon, Brody, Lewis, even you and AJ, I, I, I tried my damnedest not to care about either of you. Well, you screwed up because you did care about me. Yeah, I did. Way more than I meant to. I'm still kind of amazed we found each other, you know? Yeah, me too. Jesus, everything's so different now. Me, us, the school. I remember how Marlon described it, and what we were gonna turn Erickson into. It's not the way any of us pictured it. How did you picture it? 
I guess I couldn't. I just listened to what Marlon said, how it would be a home, a real one, but I couldn't really wrap my head around it. My family lived in a trailer. Mm, what about you? Where'd you live? I lived in a house with my mom and dad. Fence around it, big backyard. What was your favorite part of the house? I liked my bedroom. My parents painted flowers on the walls, and I had this little white bookcase. What kinds of books? Well, one of my favorites was about a family of kids living in the woods together in this old abandoned train car. Then it turned out they had this rich grandfather who took them to live in his mansion. <laughs> you got a rich grandpa who'll take us away from all this? Hmm, I don't think so. Damn. <sighs> you know, Erickson can still be the home Marlin promised. As soon as we get back, we'll start rebuilding. Hmm. <sighs> It'll be a lot of work, but you're right. It is worth it. We'll have to move some bookcases into your room. Then you can read us stories about train cars and rich grandpas. <laughs> <laughs> After all that's happened, it's still hard to imagine. I mean, we fought for it, defended it. It should feel more like home than ever, but it doesn't. You know what the problem is? Stupid fucking name, Erickson. You want to rename it? <laughs> yeah, fuck that guy. We should name it something cool. Threatening, but not like scary. You name it, it was your idea. Texas, we're calling it Texas. You can't just name it Texas. Fine. Texas, too. I want to help rebuild our school. You will, Ten. We all will. We can start as soon as we get back. Let's get home to Texas, too. Okay, just take your time and keep moving forward. It's far. Really far. Should be able to jump it. It's not that far. Yeah, I think we can. We just gotta be careful not to land too hard.
going someplace better. I want you there with me. Where everyone gets to be a person again? We're gonna go be with Mom and Dad and Sophie. Ten, snap out of it! She wants to kill you! I... I know, but I... Don't you fucking speak to him! Any of you! Do this! Don't worry, Ten. She can try to stop me. But I am not going anywhere without you. The night will be over soon. Texas too if I didn't. I did it for you. For me. 
I can't. Ten is gone! That soft little boy who liked to draw, he's gone because of you! Now's not the time, Violet. We can talk about this later, when we're safe. There's nothing to talk about. I didn't want to shoot him. He was my first real friend. But he was messing up again, just like when he got Mitch killed. So I had to decide. Glimpse that I could, so I did. Goodbye, Tony. and I'll catch you on the way down. Come on! Bye! Shit! I got it! Clem, look out! <laughs> oh, fuck. Run! Meet us back at the school. But uh, we'll make it! Go! First. A bit. We can't stay here. Keep moving forward. Keep moving forward. Keep moving. Oh. Keep moving forward. 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 